Adrian reporting for ESCplus.com here in Stockholm, the final of Melodie Festival in uh, 2019. And I have the pleasure to speak to Liz Hayas, who's competing in the final with the song Torn. Yeah. Uh, how do you feel, Lisa? It's so exciting to see you here. Yes, I'm so excited. I'm not nervous yet, but I think I will become nervous tomorrow. But I'm feeling very calm. I've done this in like two weeks uh, in a row, so I'm very calm and excited. Yeah, you, you went through another participations in the past in Melody Festival and yeah. twice. This is yeah. the third one. How does yeah. it feel different from the others? Oh, um, I feel more calm. And uh, this song is so personal to me, so it feels different to uh, be on that stage with this audience and to sing just from my heart and when it's so personal so that feels that feels amazing what what do you think would it mean different the song the torn to yeah. the others not only melody festival but in eurovision if you reach eurovision what would you think is the different element of the song that compared to the others could be standing out from the oh, rest oh that's a tough one um the thing about torn is that it's so emotional a lot of emotions uh, is in the song and uh, the thing is, my voice is my instrument. I don't play guitar or piano, and I feel like I can really challenge myself in this song. Um, it's not just a song that I sing when I wake up. Uh, I really have to prepare for this song. So it's, uh, it's a little difficult for me, but it's very fun because it's chal challenging, and I really love that. So I hope that's what stands out <laughs> okay but i don't know no i mean it's a ballad it's, it's something yeah, different uh, yeah last year and we had it's a very minimalistic it is, it is, and it truly is. just we're just focusing on the emotions and the lyrics and my my voice so that's a little different from the others i think i wanted to ask you how do you see the music business in sweden when it comes to melody festival and also the eurovision how do you think eurovision mm -hmm. melody festival is working nowadays compared to the music business that surrounds that whole things what do you mean like the, when it comes to if there a formula to win nowadays Eurovision, the patterns have changed. Neta won in, uh, yeah. in last year. Yeah. The year before, we have Portugal with a really okay. slow song. Yeah. And in Melody Festival, and, like the trends change year after year. Yeah. So how do you of see that? Of course. I don't know. It's. Uh, I think the people want other things year from year. Uh, you see that in the, the winners that win here in Sweden. It's not always a ballad that wins and not always a pop song. But I don't know. I haven't thought about that. Okay. Yeah. So if you make it to Israel, will you be open to come back another time for Eurovision or is it a once-in-a-lifetime experience for you? I think it's a once-in-a-lifetime, but I don't know. You should never say never. Um, I said never again after the second time and here I am, <laughs> third time. But I don't think it will be uh, in the near future. I okay. think it will be, if I participate again, it will be in my maybe the 30s or 40s. <laughs> okay, so how did you choose any other Swedish singers yeah. to compete in Melody Festival or make it to Eurovision? Yeah. Who is your favorite? Who would you like to represent Sweden? Ooh. Not only from, from the No, okay, parts. from from every, everywhere. everywhere. Oh, I don't know. It's a tough Ooh, question, actually. Yeah. Mm. Should it be someone that hasn't performed in... Whatever comes to your okay. mind. Okay. Then I just think of Lorian. <laughs> Nice option. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yes. Um, so, can you send us a message to the viewers on escplus.com? Uh, yes. They're watching you, they're following you. So, yeah. feel free to do it now. Hello, this is Lisa. I am very excited that you like my song and that you're following my journey. I hope you continue to do it. And uh, see you on Saturday.